Hello there everyone and welcome to our September 2018 Stamp and Die Release full reveal video. First up we have Holiday Bow Stamp Set. This is a 6x8 stamp set which contains a bow, a poinsettia and lots of different foliage. These are all layering stamps so if we turn this trifold over you can see that we do have the layering guide on the back so you can quickly and easily create these beautiful dimensional and detailed flowers and bows. As well as the stamp set, we do have the matching die set available, which contains all the dies to cut out all of the images from the stamp set. I've created a simple one layer card using this set. I've just used the poinsettia, masked this out and then added some foliage around the outside edge. Next up we have Brountiful Branch stamp set. This is a 6x8 stamp set and it contains one branch with berries. So there's eight layers to this one so it's pretty detailed. So if you flip it over you can see how many layers it's got and how, beautiful de how beautifully detailed it is. So here is the finished images and you can just see how you can stamp it up using that guide on the back there. Again, I've created a simple one layer card with this set. You can see how beautiful that branch is using all of the detailed layers and just a little bit of a bow adds to it the touch. Next up we have Starry Night stamp set. This one can, is another 6x8 stamp set. It contains a corner of stars, a starry tree, little stars as well as lots of beautiful sentiments. As well as the stamp set, we do have the matching die set available, which cuts out the tree and the little single stars that's in the stamp set as well. I've just used the border around the edge here, just using a really light colour ink and a sentiment from the set. Next up we have Blessings. This is another 6x8 stamp set and this contains lots of beautiful sentiments and a little heart there as well. I've just used this to add lots of sentiments to my card so this is one that I've already shown you and you can see how beautiful those sentiments stamp there. Next up we have California Skies. This is a really different stamp set so we have two of the um, iconic skylines from California. We have Los Angeles and Hollywood as well as lots of additional sentiments that you can add to your cards as well. Here I've just used the very top of the skyline from Los Angeles, so I've masked up the bottom just to add a little skyline to this card here. Next up we have Festive Ponsettia. This is a 4x6 stamp set with a large Ponsettia image as well as lots of beautiful and bold sentiments here. As well as the stamp set, we do have the matching die set available which cuts out that beautiful hand-drawn Ponsettia image. I've just, again, this is another simple one layer card. I've just stamped it using some embossing ink, done it with some gold embossing powder and then coloured it in with the wonderful Altenew watercolours. Next up we have Christmas Stocking Stamp Set. This is a 6x4 um, six stamp set. It contains lots of different images which you can create different kinds of stockings using the outline and create lots of images. On the background we can see here that there is different ways that you can use the stamp set and it just gives you a couple of guides just to do that. As well as the stamp set we do have the matching die available which cuts out the stocking. For this one I've created another simple card. This time I've used three of the stockings, stamped them in all different colours and arranged them on here and I've used some of the sentiments from the set too on the stockings. Next up we have From Our Home and this is a lovely sweet 2x3 stamp set which makes up a little house and has a little tree in there as well. As well as the stamp set we do have the matching die available which cuts out the house and the little Christmas tree as well. Again, I've used this on a simple card and you can see how beautiful that house looks when it's stamped up in all various colours. Next up we have Mini Christmas. Again, this is another 2x3 stamp set. It has a large Merry Christmas sentiment as well as some um, holly leaves and a holly leaf. So you can create lots of different looks using all of these elements in here. Again, another simple one layer card. I've stamped all of the images and then around the berries and the leaves, I've just gone around with a pen. Next up, we have Cozy Flannel Cover Dye. This is a really beautiful and detailed cover dye, which is four and a quarter by five and a half. So it covers the front of an A2 size card perfectly. As you can see here, that's the dye and it cuts little strips in some of the squares and then leaves some of the squares solid. So it gives you a really cool checkerboard look. 
I'm sorry, but it is very difficult to see it in the background here, but it does look very, very pretty. Next up, we have Creative Edges Evergreen Dye. So this one cuts an edge. It doesn't cut the trees out completely. It just cuts along the border. So it the trees are attached to the, your card still, but then it gets rid of the top part. So here I used it to create a, my own little stencil and you can see how beautiful that looks. Just very simple, but very, very pretty. So that's it for our September 2018 Stamp and Die release. We truly hope that you've seen something that really inspires you and makes you want to create. Again, thank you so much for watching and we'll see you again really, really soon. Bye-bye.